Some updated information here in regards to Yellowstone National Park. The world's largest active geyser, the Steamboat Geyser, which is inside of Yellowstone, has erupted three times in the past six weeks within the park, including once this week. This is a pattern that they're saying is unusual. Now, I also did a report on Yellowstone here recently with some phenomenon with something on the ground. They couldn't tell if it was a human or an animal. And then odd lights in the sky. Couldn't tell if it was a drone, a helicopter, or, or what it was. And you've also had the steamboat geyser repeatedly going off. I reported on that as well. And this geyser is a big one. It will shoot water as high as 300 feet in the air, or 91 meters into the air. It erupted on March 15th, April 19th, and then again here this past Friday. The last time it erupted three times in a year was back in 2003. So this does not mean that there's going to be some kind of imminent eruption, but it does show that there's some ever-changing events going on inside of Yellowstone. There's constant change. And, I mean, with all the thermal activity, all the vents, the geysers, the top of a super volcano... I, it's really a day by day. There's no other way around it. They can watch the ground swelling and the quake activity and all that, but super volcanoes, I really do think it's just something you have to keep up with on the daily observing to wait and see if there is those big key signs that an imminent eruption may be around the corner. And with today's technology, you would like to think that we would get a heads up before something like this but like you see in the movies all the time oh we didn't want to create panic so we're not going to say anything yeah well goes right back to the same ones that have sold us out right hope people are starting to see that anyhow wanted to update the information on this I'll leave a link this has been Dabu7 peace